Let's start with byte pair encoding tokenizer, commonly abbreviated as BPE, which is a subword tokenization algorithm that recursively merges the most frequent pairs of consecutive bytes or characters in a corpus. For instance, imagine that we have the following sentence Deep Learning Engineer. The first step that the BPE encoding does is to pre tokenize the sentence by splitting the text into words resulting in three words with frequency 1 in our case, deep, learning, and engineer. Now, we initialize the vocabulary with all the individual characters found in the sentence, and if we were to tokenize it, we would get the following, characters divided by space. Then, we iteratively merge the most frequent pair of characters, which in our case is either in or ee, and add the merge group into the vocabulary. Let's say that we choose to add in. Now, if we were to tokenize the sentence again, using the vocabulary, we would obtain the following. We can see that both the word learning and engineer are tokenized differently and now include the ink pair of characters. Next, we repeat the process and merge the tokens again and calculate the frequencies, resulting in EE having the highest frequency. So we add it to the vocabulary. Now, if we were to tokenize the sentence with the updated vocabulary, we obtain the following. We can see that both in and ee are now treated as separate tokens, which is what we expect. And again, this process of merging tokens together, based on the highest frequencies, is repeated until we reach the desired predefined vocabulary size.